Hi. So today we're talking about how same-sex marriage and the Defense of Marriage Act are not just domestic issues, but how they affect couples around the world in which one or both partners wish to immigrate to the United States. Under existent immigration regulations for binational heterosexual couples, couples in which one partner is a U.S. citizen and the other is not, the non-citizen partner is afforded priority in immigration hearings through a process known as marital sponsorship. Same-sex couples are not afforded those same benefits, and this fact is particularly relevant for asylum seekers in the United States. As you may know, in February, President Obama declared that the federal courts should stop defending DOMA's constitutionality. Binational same-sex couples were accordingly excited that their immigration cases would be more quickly resolved in a manner similar to the procedures enacted for their heterosexual counterparts. Instead, on March 28th, the United States Citizenship and Immigration Services reneged on this positive change and stated that because there had been no official policy shift with respect to same-sex marriage, they will continue to uphold discriminatory immigration procedures. We're asking you to sign a change.org change petition linked to your right, begun by the LGBT Immigration Equality Organization, Out for Immigration. The petition is directed at President Obama and asks for an executive directive to have immigration services continue prioritizing green card applications from same-sex partners of U.S. citizens.